Pat Love back from Love Healing Hearts. Here with a word of exhortation as I was contemplating with the Lord about what <clears throat> should be discussed on this video. What I kept seeing is a person in, involved in a relationship that's just getting off the ground. Now this has nothing to do with anything anybody sent me. This is just the impression I'm getting from the Lord. The relationship is potentially toxic. The relationship is potentially dangerous. And the relationship is a very controlling one. Where the person on the other end is very controlling. And you are trying so hard to please. Stop it, stop it, stop it. Bail. Pull the parachute ring. Jump. Get out of Dodge. This relationship is not going to do anything but bury you alive. I don't know who this is for. <clears throat> I don't know if you have two kids. But the feeling I'm getting is you're tired of being lonely with your two kids. You're tired of not having a relationship. You're tired of not having arms to welcome you home. In your patience, keep your soul. Don't let things fall apart at the seams. Because you're in a moment of neediness. All of us go through it. But those are the times when decisions are at their worst. You have to acknowledge God in all your ways. He will direct your path. But you have to be willing to do it his way even if you don't understand why. Why you can't have the hunk. Why you can't have the fox. Whatever the case is, be willing to obey God no matter what. Because when he says no, he's not being a killjoy. He's being a protection, a covering for you and your two kids. And if you don't have kids, take this word. Anyway. But somebody is looking at something that they shouldn't even be given a second thought to. They should be running as far as they can, as quickly as they can, away from it. Because it looks like ice cream. It looks like chocolate ice cream. It looks like your favorite flavor. But when you put that thing in your mouth, it's going to be something else. And you're going to know it. But it'll be in your mouth already. And you'll already be swallowing it before you realize you swallowed Dung, cow dung, it wasn't chocolate ice cream. But you were led to believe it was because part of you wanted to believe it so bad you lied to yourself and ignored the stench that accompanied the chocolate ice cream. You get what I'm saying? I'm talking figuratively, yeah, I know. But I think you should get the point. Just because it looks pretty and it's wrapped in a nice package does not mean there's not a bomb inside. Now, I don't know who that's for, but you better walk. You better walk as quickly as can be. And if you're getting too deep too soon, you better run. Don't walk. You better get out of there. Don't make any announcements. Don't tell people your plans. Don't let your right hand know what your left hand's doing. Do it in secret, but get, get the heck out of Dodge. Okay, I'm done. I'm not going to go any further with that. I just felt like that was a quick word of warning somebody needed to hear. God bless you to obey.